See that, see that plane? Yeah. yeah, case in point. Catherine! Catherine, would you observe the structures that are holding up that plane, please? The pontoons? Mm -hmm, exactly. Yes, my dear. That is a seaplane, which is what she failed to rent. Caused hey. us to have a nice little accident just north of here that I'll never forget. Yeah, it's pretty small. Yes, it is small. Very small. So, sweetheart, you ain't going anywhere. What? You don't even know I'm there! No, hold it. Better idea. Got it. Why don't I just take the first leg? I'm a great pilot. You can ask Katie. That way, you two can just cozy up in the back seat there and uh, get seat. reacquainted. But, uh, yeah, no, two's company. Three's a, you know, big pain in the butt. But uh, since I've been keeping your wife alive here, I really... What, 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 what do you mean? What back seat? What, what? Uh, that's what I mean. What back seat? Well, that's a two-seater plane. So anybody want to guess what cross-dressing cutie pie gets to stay behind? Cross-dressing. You make a habit of this? Hey. Hey. How'd it go with Cass? He was booked. I'll catch him later. Where were you? I was taking this outfit out for a walk. I wanted to see if it works. Oh, it works. Really? Yeah. Do you like that? <laughs> Do you think it's good? It's great. <laughs> you're a terrific designer. I hope so. Yeah, you're, you're gonna make it. You are. You just keep doing what you're doing. I know. I actually, I wanted to it's, talk to if, you. Once I get everything squared away with Cass, maybe I can help you out. You know, if you need some fabric or anything. Oh, that's so sweet, honey. Thank you. Now, Cass has got to come through. Well, I'm sure you will. But you have to remember that you're not alone anymore, I know, Jack. I know. I know it's you and your pride. <sighs> And that's great, but you gotta remember it. It's the two of us together hey, now. Hey, you got any ideas? I'm open. Well, <laughs> actually, I do. Only you're not gonna like it. Do you stay up nights dreaming of ways to make my job more difficult? Is that every client's prerogative? You're not the only one who's at risk here. I'm fully prepared to testify that I lied to you about Barbara giving me permission for use of BRO funds. I don't want you testifying at all. That would be disastrous. Our best refuge, our only refuge, is the Fifth Amendment. Thou shalt not incriminate thyself, nor thy attorney, nor anyone else, if you can possibly help it. Think of the book you'll get out of this. For myself? It'll be okay. Remember, I didn't do it. walk me through this. Yeah, well, I was never in here. To be here while she was burned. My client will answer your questions, but only insofar as they pertain to the night in question. It's all right, guys. She's my sister, too. Tell her anything she wants. 